Okay, guys, so we're here at Hitesh's booth. Say hi. Hi. So hi, he's hi. actually in my Patreon, and you're from India, right? Yeah, I'm from India. Okay, and he's a vendor here at the Tucson Gem Show. So I'm going to give you guys a little bit of a tour of his booth, and then we'll probably come back because he's supposed to get new stuff next week. <laughs> Meta crystals. Okay, so this is what his booth looks like, and this is where you can find him. There is his name right there and his contact, and then Meta Crystals is the name of his business. And here is his booth here at the Pueblo Show. You can find him, so book binders right there, so you can find him just along here. So he has a ton of jewelry, right? Lots of really beautiful pieces. We were just looking at this Apothelite, which is stunning. But what are some of your favorite pieces you have today? Yeah, don't say it's yet, but lights. This is the one. Oh, yeah. Pretty. Yeah. And what's kind of the price range that you have today? Uh, uh, the price range starts from, say, $15 to maximum $120 more than that. Oh, wow. So really affordable. Yeah, affordable. Especially These are jewelry. the pink Himalayan uh, Nirvana quartz crystals, Ooh. which are rare to find. I might be picking some of those up. Yeah. These are Herkima diamonds. Inside. Oh, wow. That's so cool. Here, let me put my hand that. Oh, yeah. wow. That's yeah. so pretty. Oh, my gosh. Yeah. And you just pay 15 for this. Wow. That's a great <laughs> price. Air <laughs> diamonds are so expensive. Yeah. Moldavites. Ooh. Oh, wow. That's a big Moldavite. <laughs> Look at that, you guys. That is a massive piece of Moldavite. I don't think I've ever seen one that big. Wow. That's beautiful. You got a lot of Moldavites. Yeah. And what is this material right this here? This is still white. Oh, wow. Beautiful. These are rubies. Ooh. Those are so pretty. Oh, and this one's carved, huh? Yeah, that's ruby carved. Wow. Is that UV reactors? I, I need to check that out. I haven't yet. Probably might be. That would be yeah. pretty cool. Super cool. Okay, and let's go over here. These are earrings section. All of them. Wow. Lots of different stones. Yes, Beautiful. Wow. And these are all pendants. Really pretty. Ooh, I like that one. It's given sleep. Yep. Beautiful. You don't see that material very no, often. No, it's very hard to find. Ooh, and Larimar. Yeah. Those are gorgeous. Is this a tree? Yes. Oh, wow. 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 My favorite. <laughs> Larimar and Citrine. Wow. That's a huge Citrine. Well, then you can't avoid this because the prices are very stunning. It's oh, wow. Very it has like a phantom in it. Yes. yes. That's beautiful. A couple of pieces have phantom in it. This oh, has yeah. phantom in it. This has phantom in it. This one does too. Yeah. This little baby one. Wow. So pretty, and these Laramars are gorgeous. Look at that, really nice quality. Sometimes you can find not the greatest quality. And this is all, is this all 925 yes, sterling? Yes, yes, all 925 Ooh, an Amatrine, look at yes. these. That's really pretty. These are all really nice too. And then what are these? These are aquamarines. Oh, aquamarine. Yeah, beautiful. Is that Peter Ooh, Peter That's also one of my favorites. <laughs> All my faves. Yeah. Is that a piece? Okay. There you go. Green Adventuring. Green Adventuring. Those are really nice quality. Thank you. Beautiful. And these are Himalayan cords with chloride. Oh, Jesus. wow. I'll just show you. You won't be able to look like this. But That's super yes. unique. These are the phantoms inside. Wow. So these are Himalayans with chlorite. That's a beautiful pendant. That's so cool. Do you have some with pinks on them? Uh, like pink Himalayan? Pink Himalayan are on their way, actually. <laughs> just the green? Yeah, just the green. A girl can dream, right? <laughs> but the green is really pretty. It's actually really hard to find the green with the chlorite. Yeah. It's becoming more popular. And here's his business card, too. If anyone wants to take a screenshot 
and a QR code as well. Yeah, the website is on development, so QR code might be active after a month or so. But yeah, okay. you can scan that. No Perfect. Problem. And they can reach out to you yes, any yes. of these ways. Definitely. And you, you have bigger stones too yes, that are yes, coming. So we'll come back. But this is all of the jewelry, which I think is amazing. That you can shop with him at Pueblo. And then we'll come back for some of the big stones. Ooh, we got another. Oh, wow. That's beautiful. That's Ruby, right? Yes, that's Ruby. Wow. <laughs> that's so pretty. <laughs> I love it. Oh, this one's really cool. Yes. this. Oh, it's amethyst? Wow, it's like Double really dark. Amethyst. Is it like a celestial? Yes, it is a celestial. Wow, that's cool. I might need that. That's so unique. Look at that. It's stunning. See if I can get it. There we go. Pretty. Oh my god, that's cool. That's the phantom inside of it. It's smoky down set and it's double terminated. Wow, that's beautiful. That's yeah. super unique. Yeah. I love that. Such a cool piece. Yeah, you can see the edge part of it, right? Yeah, it has like, some people call it crocodile. Or yeah. it's, that's super, that's a really unique combination. Wow, there's lots of really fun pieces. You guys gotta come and just dig around and look at everything. Cause there's little hidden treasures among <laughs> all of this stuff. And he's happy to help explain what everything is. And again, really affordable price points like this Herkimer diamond you said was 15. Yes. What a steal. So many good things. Ooh, and these super high quality rose quartz. This almost looks like gems. Are these rose quartz? Yes, they are rose quartz. Wow, I was like, wow, I had to second guess myself. It's beautiful. Ooh, what's this? That's super cool. Wow. These are all the Himalayans. Himalayan. The citrine are there. Rough stone. Oh. These are the citrines. There's some rough citrines here. Golden Rutile quartz. Oh, wow. These are golden rutiles. Rutile is so hard to find and it's yes. so expensive. Yes. Wow. Yeah, these are citrines. Rough are citrine and yeah. these are the rutiles. Ooh. Really nice. Yeah. Sorry, it's a little blurry. Ooh, what's this? Is this a yeah, rutile? Golden, yeah, it has got golden rutile. You can see a hairline. Yeah. Can be, camera can't capture it, but it has chloride as well as golden rutile. See? That's so cool. There's like a skinny little rutile hair in there, and it's a big faceted. That's beautiful. Wow. Oh, I love Some it. Oh, yeah, super flashy. flashy. Wow. Ooh, look at that. Beautiful. Yeah, uh, this one is naturally epiphyllite, which is titanium. Uh, the uh, surface is glowing with the rainbow colors in it. You can, you can just see. Oh, wow. These are natural. Oh, yeah. I see it. That's so pretty. That's apophyllite? Yes, that's apophyllite. Wow, it looks like aura almost. Yeah, it's an aura apophyllite. <laughs> that's so but cool. That's natural. Natural aura. Yeah. Ooh. That's so it's cool. Oh, oh, these are so pretty. I've been having so many customers loving jewelry now, so I'm so excited to get something. This is hand uh, crafted. And there is a big piece which is oh, being wow. like this because it should break down when we hammer it. Oh, so wow. very, uh, it has to be done very, very delicately, and the artist only can do this kind of stuff. That's so cool. So that's a big giant pendulum. Yeah. Super cool. That's beautiful. And what material is that? Crystal. Oh, just the Himal Himal raw Himal yeah. Himalayan. Himalayan. Beautiful. Ooh, I love that. Oh, and there's another one over here. Yeah. That's so pretty. Oh, and there's more. You guys have to really come and dig around because you'll find some little These treasures. Are also These are also there. Oh, yeah. Need some of the stones. So combination because. Beautiful. Ooh, and these are the sunstones? Sunstone. Yes. These are really high quality sunstones. Look at the flash on those. Wow. Woo. Those probably shine so flashy in the sun. <laughs> and these are these citrine too? Yeah, uh, these are lemon quartz. Oh, lemon quartz. Yeah. Okay, so you guys, a lot of people are asking me the difference between lemon quartz and citrine. Um, you guys see the difference? It it's is a more big on difference. It's a lemonish shade and it has more of an orange shade. Yeah. yeah. And I'll, I'll just add it. So cool. 
So that's how you can tell. The color says it all, but it is, these are high quality lemon quartz too. And there are a uh, couple of pieces that are UV reacting. So this is one of them. Oh, wow. That's so cool. You can't see that on this. So this is from the another mine. This oh, is wow. So this is UV reacting at the camera. Oh, wow. So it UVs like an orange. Yes, see. That's so cool. Wow. And the citrine probably wouldn't re UV wouldn't, react. Wouldn't no, no, no. So that's another way to check if it's lemon quartz, yeah, some yeah. of that UV Some of them, because uh, these are from the uh, other mine, or the uh, layer of the uh, digging also de uh, depends on that. At which level the uh, lemon quartz has been dug there. Oh, wow. There. Okay. So sometimes you get reactive, sometimes you don't get reactive. But that's, so that's so cool. So it depends on how deep it yeah. was mined. Yeah. Wow. That's so cool. Okay, and these are the Herkimers. He has like a little basket of them over here. I'm gonna pull one out and show you guys. And then I'm gonna go shopping. <laughs> <laughs> We're gonna shop his booth. Oh, wow. That's beautiful. So they're like all inside of inside, that. Inside, yeah. There are two sides of the suits, and in between, there are Herkimer diamonds. Wow. Beautiful. These are quartz. Awesome. Quartz cabochons are both the size. That's so cool. And then while you're here at Pueblo, what kind of payment do you take? Uh, I accept cash and card booth. Cash and card. Okay, cash and card, guys, if you want to come shop his booth. And I will put all the details in the video description here. And then I'm going to pick out some things for myself. And I'll do a separate little haul video, guys, so you can see what I ended up getting. All right. <laughs> Say goodbye and we'll see you next year at Tucson. <laughs> hey guys, this is my haul. There's Daisy from the Discord. Hi. Hi. <laughs> I was like, I have to put it there now because you guys are both here. All right, you guys. So I am going to share all the things I got from Hitesh today. He is from India and he is a supplier. He supplies some gorgeous jewelry, but also some other really beautiful raw pieces and polished pieces, but I picked up some jewelry today. He should have some new material at his Pueblo booth in the next few days, but I wanted to share all the gorgeous jewelry pieces I got. So I'm gonna start with my favorite piece, which is this piece, you guys. This is insane. So what this piece is, is it's a gorgeous celestial amethyst and I've never really seen anything like it. And it has a little citrine gem right there. But look at those fractures and include ooh, rainbow. This is such a stunning piece and this is all 925 sterling silver, but unbelievable piece. And then I love this piece so much. I had to get this one, which this is a smoky amethyst celestial on 925 sterling silver and it is absolutely gorgeous i'm going to hold it up to the light a little bit better so you can see but isn't that incredible a smoky amethyst celestial it's just so hard to find this kind of material and this is a stunner of a piece. Next up, we have this gorgeous green apoph light piece. This is again on the 925 sterling silver. So pretty. I really love this piece. It's just super saturated. And then I also got a little mini one because I know some people like smaller pieces. So I got this little mini green apoph light as well, which this one is so cute. And these pieces are really cool. He had some really fun natural clusters with aura on them. And this is natural aura. It's not man-made or heat treated aura. And I believe, I believe this is apothalite as well with natural aura, but it's really, really unique. I've never seen anything like that. And again, this is the 925 sterling silver raw on the back, but a really gorgeous piece. And then I also picked up a seven chakra tourmaline pendant. I know some people have been really interested in these. So I picked up one of those. 
And this is a super unique piece. This mini bluestone at the top is canvasonite. And then there is the pendant that is made out of scolocyte, which is so cool. I've stocked scolocyte before, but in palm stones, this is a really cool, super unique pendulum. I did only pick up one pendulum for now. And then I wanted to share these pieces. These are so unique. So these are actually pink Himalayan, but they're in pendant form, which I think is so cool. You guys know I carry pink Himalayan quartz and Hitesh also sells pink Himalayan quartz, I believe, or Himalayan quartz in his shop as well. But these are gorgeous jewelry pieces, absolutely stunning. And then I also got this one. I thought this one was really gorgeous as well. It's a little bit bigger than the other one, but has a really nice natural markings on it. And again, I think it's just so cool to have pink Himalayan quartz in pendant form. Then I also picked up these gorgeous natural raw citrine pendants. I had some people asking if I would have natural citrine necklaces, but this is as close as you can get. You just have to add your own chain. These are absolutely stunning. They're really beautiful on the back. And I picked up two of these just slightly different colors but really gorgeous and these are 100 authentic natural citrine which is really hard to find so happy to see those and then this piece is really insane so this is a himalayan quartz piece with rutile inside and i don't know if you can see the rutile right there but holy hannah the clarity on this piece is out of this world World. And this was like the most insane, gorgeous piece. It has a really gorgeous formations. And this is going to make a very spiritual, very powerful necklace. I'm tempted to keep this one, but this is like an insane piece. Oh, I also picked up just some really simple black tourmaline pendants. These will be super affordable. And this piece is really cool. So this is a Herkimer diamond and it almost has an elestial formation and it has carbon inside it. That's what turns it this kind of smoky black color, but absolutely gorgeous. And again, 925 sterling silver. Oh, absolutely love this piece. I only got one Herkimer diamond. Big one but I did pick up these mini Herkimer diamonds they're like little Herkimer diamonds inside pendant and then they have a stone on the bottom so each one has a different stone but these are just gorgeous they're mini Herkimer diamonds in there these will make a very beautiful necklace and then I thought this one was absolutely stunning really really druzy this is a potholite with canvasonite again and it's just such a beautiful piece. Look at the back. I thought this would make such a special pendant. I really love this piece. And the next piece we have is a peach still bite. Oh, gorgeous. And you guys take these out into the sun when you get them. They are absolutely stunning. Just gorgeous, gorgeous formations, completely natural stones on these 925 sterling pendants. And then this one is super cool. These are pink apotholite and they're absolutely gorgeous. They're set on 925 sterling silver. I love these so much. The color is so beautiful and it's naturally colored this way. Who doesn't love pink druzy? I also picked up this piece, absolutely stunning. I really like the shape of this and the color saturation is gorgeous. And then absolutely beautiful on the back. It's just rough on the back, but oh, these are some of my favorite pieces. I was super drawn to these when I first got to his shop. And you guys, this one is so cool. So this is the Sunset Phantom Quartz and this point is completely natural. It's not polished like this. It was pulled out of the ground like this. I actually read in the mineralogical record that this trade name is actually Maharaja Quartz, which is so pretty, but it's known as Sunset Phantom Quartz or Hematite Quartz. It has many trade names, but it's from India. And this piece is just on another level. I only got one of these, but he did say that he could get more of this material. So if you guys are interested in this material, definitely reach out to him and contact him. So 
those are all of the insane, amazing jewelry pieces I got. I have to say my top three are probably these Alestials. Oh, I can't even pick three. Like I love these. I love the citrines. I love the pink Himalayans. This baby is just on another level with the root tile in it. So gorgeous. And these pink Apothalites are gorgeous. The still bite, everything is absolutely gorgeous. So if you guys are looking for some really beautiful material from India, Hitesh is the person you should reach out to. He also has a ton of other minerals, including citrine and minerals native to India and other minerals from all around the world. I'm so excited to list and share these gorgeous pieces with you guys. And I hope you guys enjoyed this direct from Tucson unboxing and we might I do more of these in the future. Thank you guys so much for watching. I will leave all of the contact information for Hitesh down below in the description box and I hope you guys enjoyed. Please make sure to like and subscribe and I will see you guys on the next one. Love you. Bye.